Hey everybody, this is Ashley with Publish with Ashley. I am so glad to have you here. I was, basically this is gonna be about creating a video or like a YouTube intro. So I had posted on my Facebook group my uh, new intro to my um, YouTube channel and you know asked to think what you know what you all thought and people were like oh, how'd you do that? So I said Canva. So I wanted to show you guys how to make a video or maybe an intro video for YouTube or you know you can use this to maybe put on um, a website or something you know to introduce a product or one of your books or anything but I, I just thought this was a cool school skill and someone had asked me so that being said let's get started <laughs> All right, everybody, I am back and here I am on Canva. See, that was my intro you just saw. And we're gonna learn how to make pretty much something exactly like that here on Canva. Okay, now what you're gonna do is, kind of the easy way to do this is templates. And then um, you can have what actually where it is right now, a uh, YouTube intro is actually the place you can find it right now. Um, you probably can click on social media and find a YouTube intro, but um, for right now, if you go under templates, YouTube intro, so YouTube intro is what you're looking for. And if you click on that, all right, it is open. So what we're gonna do is you can scroll down. Uh, it'll kind of, you know, give you a little bit of intro, but you can kind of look. There's a lot of these that are free. There are some that are not free, but there are quite a few that are free YouTube intros. So you can kind of just go and see which one you like or what you'd like to do. Uh, I opened up a few before I kind of decided on this one. So this is the template I used for my own. And so I opened that up. And this is actually really, really pretty easy. I'm gonna hit use this template. And the idea, think of it like, kind of like slides. Each slide is animated. So in this, you'll see, if you scroll down, so you've got ready, set, goulash, <laughs> goulash, right? The ready, set, goulash. Okay, so all you're going to do is just update the colors and change these to however you want to do it. So, and right here is where you control how long these slides last. Um, so they can be, you know, shorter or longer. We'll just have them be really short for right now, just so you can see, but you can change the colors. So click on the back and you can pick different colors. Um, so I'm gonna do this and I'll just keep it that peach. I like that peach, but you can see how you can change it. You can change any of that to be whatever colors you want. So you can change on that and change the text color. So if you wanted it to be, you know, gray or um, white, white, yeah, white stands out pretty good. And then maybe we'll give, let's see if we can get this to do a color. Yeah. No, I'll just leave it white because I don't want to fiddle with it. But you can fiddle with it and see if you can get it to be a different color if you want. Let's go back to the first one. Ready, set. So let's go back and pick again that blue color. And I'm going to change ready to white like the other one. So now it says ready, set, goulash. And you could do it the other way. Let's say you wanted to have the, let's say, ready in blue. And then set, what you're going to do is, let's say we're going to do this in a white and then you're gonna change the set to this blue so that you could like change it up maybe the darker blue um, so if you wanted to change up the colors I'm just gonna go back and keep it all the same color but you could do something like that to kind of give it some variety you can use your brand colors so yet again I'm gonna go over here and click and I'm going to let's see I'm gonna actually highlight this part and I'm going to put that as white and then I'm going to leave this that color and I'm going to put go publish right and that is too big you can see so I've highlighted the whole thing make it 
smaller. Eh, we'll try 350 so I don't have to keep hitting the button. A little bit less, maybe 340. Oops, now it did it really big. All right, 340, there we go. Maybe that's still too big. There we go, I like that. All right, so that's kind of what you've got. And you can see, you can now fiddle with like the timing. Uh, if you want one second, 0.8 seconds. So if you had like a, you know, something you were gonna say or you wanted to time it, you can make it longer. It just depends on how long you want it to be. Um, and then what I did here is I actually put in, you know, publish. I put in my logo, but I'm just going to show you to show you how to change the background. Publish with Ashley. Okay, and then I'm going to delete all that. Delete that. And delete this little guy. I'm gonna center. Let's see. Pull that over. Sometimes, ah, the box. Well, I can't make the box be the kind I want it to be, so I'm just going to insert my own box. Okay, so let's make this center and move this over. Okay, there we go, it's centered right there. Now I'm going to insert, don't worry about the, the goulash in the back there. In fact, I'll just delete it. And I'm going to make this, there's a shape. There we go. Cover that. That's probably about big enough. And then I'm going to position it backward. I'm going to change its color. And we're going to change the color of this text to be white. All right, now I need a video in the back, right? So what you can do over here is you can go down to videos. And I had this one that I found. This is a pro one, but you can go look for um, videos that are free that maybe you would like that's, um, let's see, let's do like sparkles or something. Sparkles. Um, here's a free 15 second one. Um, remember, you can change the time, so don't stress if you're like, oh, that's really long. Here, those are not free. No, nope, we'll just use this free one up here just so you can kind of see how it works. Um, but you can change this. If you don't like this video, uh, you can change it to a different video. Just find one that you like. And I'm going to move it so that it's there. Okay. Now, right here, this how I'm going to crop it. So you can just basically, let's say you want it to be four seconds long. So just four S. There you go. So it's only going to be four seconds long now. Now, the other thing people ask me how you do is how do you change, this is basically the, it gives you soundtrack. <laughs> um, you can listen, this is actually pretty funny, it's not uh, what you would actually want to use, it's, um, but you can go in here, it's like a <laughs> bagpipes, or not bagpipes, but what do they call it, accordion, it sounds like an accordion music, but you can go in here to audio, over here and pick something. I think I picked for mine, Pretty People. It's pro, but there are a lot of different free ones under here um, that you can probably find uh, just here free there. Um, and you can just pick. <laughs> the free ones aren't necessarily free. That's pretty funny, but some are. Uh, just try and find one maybe under Bright or Happy. There's a free one. Um, so just go. There's not as lot of free... Uh, Oh, maybe club sync, right? Okay, we'll just put that in. And you can actually go in here and change where it will. So if you can hear that. But you can change where. So see how I'm moving. 
I moved it over, so that's what it's going to play. And then you can you can change the volume so it's not so loud. Okay, that's quieter, right? But you can actually go through and figure out what you like of this soundtrack and then move this highlight, move it over to be where you want it to be. Um, and that's kind of it. That's, let's see, we can preview it. So you can hit play. And then you can download it. And I know that's it kind of skipped, but sometimes when you're doing the preview, it it doesn't work. So we'll hit the preview again. Okay, it started in the middle. So just go back to the beginning. Sometimes the preview is a little funky. I think that has to do with the internet. There you go. That is it. Like I said, I think this, it's kind of stuttering like that because I am trying to video film, but when you download it, it works just fine. Uh, or if you find it doesn't download quite right, just try and re-download it. Sometimes there's an error when you're downloading just due to the internet connection. Uh, so that's pretty much it. You can see the, the different slides and they each have a time and they each have a little video kind of going on. And it really is pretty easy to make a fun and interesting, um, in this case, YouTube intro. But if you just use a little bit of creativity and search through here and find what works for you, you can do trailers, um, little videos like this using, um, I, I love this combo of like different animations and then you have different slides or pages. It just goes to each page right after it finishes the other one. So I hope this was really helpful. I thought this was fun. I was playing with it, um, but you can just add in your own soundtracks, videos, um, and you, you basically you're using it a lot like you're using it to create interiors and covers, but you're adding videos. So I hope this was helpful and check out my website. Make sure to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel or join my Facebook group, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.